Well, Iowa uh, came in for two sets. You guys managed to take both of them from this one's a little bit closer than the last one, though. Yeah, for sure. We knew they were going to come out uh, with a big effort tonight. Uh, you know, they're a good team. They, they skate fast and they come with a lot of pressure. So uh, we knew we knew uh, that that was going to happen tonight. But uh, our game plan stays the same. You know, every game is different, and you know, for for us, it's, it's it's all about you know working for a full 60 minutes and going at it shift after shift. Working for a full 60 minutes, Darcy Kemper uh, put in a full 60 minutes. Yeah. More for sure on the other end. Of the yeah, game. yeah, for sure. You did really good tonight. You know, we you know we put a lot of pucks on that then. Uh, we wanted to get a little more traffic in front of them, and uh, I think it showed on the first goal and Wayne's goal. And you know we had a good screen there from uh, from Brett Ritchie. So uh, you know it's little things like this, and you know that that, that makes a, a team successful. How was talk about every night being different? How was a night like tonight where there's a lot of shots? Is, is that when you're in that type of game, does it lead to pulling the trigger a little bit faster just because how things been going? Is that? Yeah, for sure. You know, if, every time you get a chance, you know, whether in, in, you're in a slot, and sometimes, you know, if you got guys going to net, if you're in the corner, you know, a good play might be just to throw it as fast because you never know what's going to happen, right? So, um, yeah, putting pucks on net, you know, it's, it's, it's been a, one of our goals every night. It's, you know, to get, to get like 45, 15 shots, 15, 15 shots a period, you know, and, uh, you know, get a big total like this. And, and that's how we're going to get the two points at the end. What do you guys do when you, you go through the second, after the first period, where you guys get 20 shots in the first period, and they uh, all played them for, most, for the most part, definitely five on five. They had some good chances during the power play. But when you come into the first period, just as a leader, you talk to the, do you talk to the guys about saying, hey, we're playing well, let's not be deflated that we didn't get rewarded? Do you, do you talk yeah, to the guys like exactly. that? Yeah, exactly. You know, just like you said, you, you know, you, you, you don't get a goal. Up or down, you stick with a system. And, you know, that's something that we, we really stress on, you know, in, in the locker room. It's, no, no matter what happens, even if you're if you're down a goal or you know if you're up a goal, you, your your plan's got to stay the same, and you know you got to keep working at it. And I think that's what we did today. You know, even if they got one really late, you know, but so be it. You just got to keep working and try to get the other one. And you know, if, if it takes five more minutes in, in overtime, and if it takes a shootout, you know, we'll we'll be ready for it. Can you talk through the uh, the game-winning goal there in overtime? What happened? Uh, you know, they kind of just uh, got a chip out of the zone, and uh, when I went back to the zone, I actually. Uh, Heard Justin Dahl, and I think he yelled. I think everybody in the in the rink heard him. So, uh, you know, I just turned around and fired and fired. You know, one of our uh, keys to the games is it's working our transition a lot. And uh, you know, when you got uh, fast guys like this, you know, you got Justin Dahl with the puck. You know, who who can make a lot of plays happen. You know, and, and then he found uh, Steve uh, Steve's going down now on the on the far side. So, and shot on net. You know, that's all it is. Shot on net, and you know, a little screen. And you never know what can happen. Can you talk about what uh, your partner uh, Hubert Labrie brings to the game and what he's been showing these past couple games? <laughs> a little, a little bulldog. That's how, that's how I call him. You know, he's uh, he's all over the ice. He's, he's so hard to play against. You know, and you know, guys in the locker room love him. You know, he's uh, he's such a good guy, and uh, you know, he'll put his 100 percent, you know, effort every night. And we we know it's it's you know every night, every time he steps on the ice, we know it's you know we know what we're getting. So uh, it's it's really good to have a guy like like him in the lineup and. You know, he's he's uh, he's just gonna get better. The more he gets on the ice, he's just gonna get better every night. So, and uh, you know, he works hard. Even in practices, he's always working hard. So, uh, you know, having a guy like this is great in the locker room. Thanks a lot, man. Thanks a lot, man.